Hi guys, so today I'm going to do the Santa's tag and I'm sorry for the lighting. I am in the middle of studying for finals but I wanted to take a break and film a video so this is the best lighting I could find for the time of day and what my apartment looks like at this point um, because the room I normally film in, um, my husband is doing something in there and <laughs> my books are everywhere because that's the study room. So I'm going to do it here. This is our living room, these are our lovely couches. The way the Santa tag works is that each letter starts the question. The S is show us your favorite Christmas pajamas. I don't really have any like sets of pajamas. I have a lot of bottoms and then I just use t-shirts for tops because I have a ton of t-shirts. So my favorite bottoms that are Christmas are just these. They're black with multicolored snowflakes on them. I think I've had them for two or three years. Um, they're by the brand So. And I got them for Christmas one year and they're perfect. Um, they're so soft and then they have all these colors in them and I am a matchy person in case you were, <laughs> didn't know. So I have to match even at bedtime so these are perfect for me. Okay, a smell that reminds you of Christmas. A smell that reminds me of Christmas. There's not like a smell that reminds me of Christmas. Um, I just, when I think of Christmas, I think of being like cold <laughs> because where I live is cold. And so I just think of a fire and because around the holidays we start like having to have fires um fire in the fireplace not like fires in our houses and the number one thing on your christmas list this year and i don't really have anything that's like number one that i really really want i have a lot of things that are like kind of on the same level um and i have like there's nothing i super need there be things i like so like one thing would probably be like American Eagle gift card just because they have like black jeans and basics and like scarves and some basics that would be nice but that there's nothing that's like I want this for sure I guess. Tell us the best gift you've ever received and the best you've ever given. Um, the best gift I have ever received and it's nothing to do with the gift per se is the first Christmas my husband and I were together. Um, we just been to any few months and he did work at Best Buy so we did get a discount but he got me an iPod and it was <laughs> just the reasons behind he gave giving it to me were really what I liked and then um, like people's reactions were really like, funny because of course we'd only been in a few months and that's an expensive Christmas gift and it was something that I used to use his a lot so he got me my own so I could use it so I didn't have to use his and he knew I liked it and it was just like a really good gift um, not because of how expensive it was but just like the meaning behind it I guess um, so yes and then I really couldn't think of a Christmas gift that really that like stood out a lot of like Christmas I feel like isn't a holiday that I put a lot of thought into which is probably not a good thing um, but like for birthdays and like Mother's Day and Father's Day and stuff I put a lot more effort into it um, not exactly sure why but that's just what I do and so I guess we'll just go with that like a gift I gave then and I thought of a Mother's Day gift um, I got a card and I cut it in half and I wrote a poem on the inside and stuck it in a two frame picture frame and so that was probably the best gift that I like giving it because my mom still has it in her room because it's for my mom. Yeah. A is angel or star on the top of your tree and I have an angel. I would show you to you right now but the sun is like blinding it. Um, I can insert a picture now. Yes, share an old picture of you during the holiday season. Now I'm not at home right now so I don't have a lot of like baby pictures and I was trying to look because sometimes my ornaments have old pictures of me and one I could find um, is this you can see it um, that's me and that's my teddy bear um, so yes T treasure traditions and my traditions a lot of them happen on Christmas Eve and that is we go to our Christmas Eve service at our church and then we go see lights and then when we were really little um, we would open one or two presents on Christmas Eve and then we would go to bed and then when we wake up and me and my brother I maybe one year woke up before our parents but hardly ever woke up before our parents so they were always up and then we would open our stockings and then we would have a Christmas brunch where we have this delicious egg and cheese and bacon casserole and bread and like hot chocolate and stuff like that 
um, and then we open gifts and then we really don't do much the rest of the day. Um, recently, they, my parents have been trying to make a movie a tradition after all of that um, and it's worked some years and then just hasn't worked. Um, so they're still trying on that one. But, so we'll see. I don't know if we're going to do it this year or not. A. A beauty product you cannot live without over Christmas. There's two um, types of beauty product, but one I've talked about so much, and that's just like chapstick with a little bit of color that I'm not going to talk about it again. Um, I picked something completely different and new for me, and that is the Stila Kitten, and it's just shimmery. It's really shimmery there in that lighting. Um, a really shimmery, beautiful color, um, bronzy color. And it's perfect for the holidays, um, especially like Christmas morning, because you can like, and I just wake up and like just put minimal makeup on, um, at least to start with. And you can just sweep this all over your eyelid and it gives you so much sparkle. Or if you have like a dark smoky eye and you just like insert a little bit of this, it's perfect. And it, um, I did use this in my fall makeup look which I can link down below and I really enjoy this. The last one is greatest Christmas dessert you've ever had. Now like I said my family doesn't do Christmas dinner they just have Christmas brunch and so um, we don't really have a lot of desserts like we just have basic like sugar cookies and like, different things like that before um, Christmas. There's nothing like on Christmas I guess that like we always have for dessert because we don't have dessert I guess if that makes sense um since it's brunch we just don't um my favorite Christmas like food is this egg bacon egg and cheese casserole my mom makes it's delicious and it's gone so fast and I'm so excited to have that um so that is my Santa tag I'm sorry for the lighting it's crazy and I've had to stop this video like four or five times because like I said I was studying for finals and so a couple people were texting me about that and then we're making checks in it, so every 15 minutes that thing goes off and it happened to start right obviously in the middle of one and um, then we're trying to get our thank you notes done for our wedding, which I know was a long time ago, but we used to have a lot going on and so I feel like it's craziness right now. Um, but yes, so that was my tag. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it's not too choppy for you and I hope you have a great Christmas.